Hi everybody, this is Sonia, and I'm here to show you um, my cross stitch work in progress and a finish. So, and I also do have a purchase to show you. Okay, so my finished is the wedding sampler, and I already have um, washed it, it's framed, so I'm going to show it to you. I'm getting ready to mail it tomorrow, so I wanted to show it to you. And there it is. Completely finished. And this was a dimensions pattern. And I found it simple. It was quick. And even the cursive. I had never done cursive before. And that seemed to go really quickly as well. So anywhere, anyway, there it is. I've completed that. Now for my work in progress, which is Tank the Bulldog. I'm almost done. Almost done with him. So I should definitely be done by my next video. Let me see. I have completed quite a bit on him. So there he is. I'm now working the center right here and then I just have right down the side to do and then he is finished. So the wedding sampler was, like I said, it was easy. So I was able to spend a little bit more time on tank um, over this last week. So that really helped. So next week, everybody keep their fingers crossed that I should have tank done by next week. And I do have a purchase. And it is a baby hanger. And I got this off of a website called bonanza.com. And it's kind of like eBay a little bit. Um, so if anyone has, you know, ever wondered about it or has ever uh, has not heard about it, go check it out. It's a neat little website. Anyway, I got this. And I want to sit, tell a little story about it. In 1988 or 89, I had purchased one of these for my cousin's baby. And I made it. It was my first cross stitch ever. It was very simple. And now that baby is an adult and she is getting ready to have a baby. And she was showing her grandma all of the things in the baby's room. And she had her baby hanger in her baby's room and she showed it to the grandma and she said I think Sonia made this and she said yes she made that for you when you were born she goes I would love to have one with my baby's name on it to put in the room and so her grandma told me about that so I was able to find one a vintage one this is a Bogart craft so it's quite old I was able to come up with one, so I'm going to make it and put her baby's name on it and give it to her as a gift. So I just thought that that was really neat that she had carried it around with her and used it since, you know, 1988, 89. So anyway, I just wanted to share that with you. So I will be working on this. This is, her baby is going to be born in August. So. I got that to start work on that slowly. So anyway, that is all that I have for this time. Um, thank you so much for watching, for subscribing, commenting. Um, I really enjoy all the comments and the questions.